The hummingbird is one of the most innocent looking animals on earth, zipping from flower to flower just as a crackhead zips from sketchy gas station to sketchy gas station. But take a trek to the jungles of Central America and you might just see a bird that looks identical to a gigantic hummingbird. Except that instead of craving flower nectar, its menu is a lot more protein packed. And trust me, it violates its prey worse than most animals I've seen. I'm on the search for a yakamar, and I've come to the jungles of Costa Rica to do so. This country is teeming with so many carnivorous birds, from your typical raptors like the Greyhawk, to the gigachad bully that is the Kiskadi. But the yakamar has to be one of the most unique looking. With a massive lance-like beak and iridescent green feathers, you're not going to find another bird like this outside of your grandma's hummingbird feeder. But to find it is a lot easier said than done. So to track this guy down and get some footage, I went with a guide to a popular birding spot. But this habitat is so packed with awesome birds that it didn't take long to find something to completely distract me from my goal. Crawling through the canopy was this, a faciated ant shrike. Another little known predator of the Costa Rican jungle, this bird usually scrounges for prey on its own, but how it earned the name ant shrike is for a very bizarre behavior. They'll sometimes follow army ant colonies on hunting raids, and this bird will eat anything trying to fly away from the swarm. I managed to film both the male and female, which really got my ornithology nerdiness tingling, but I needed to get back on track to find the bird I came here to see. Yakamar usually perch on high, exposed branches, giving them a good lookout point to spot potential prey. However, the odds of one of these being in clear sight is pretty low, so to track this bird down, it's better to listen. The Yakamar makes a truly bizarre call that makes it sound like a bomb about to explode. So to find one, all I gotta do is track down its anxiety-inducing screeching, and it led me right to what I was looking for, a rufous-tailed Yakamar. Now I know the video quality is absolute trash, but at least I can show you and, and it's gone. Wow. Wow, that's uh that's unfortunate. Luckily, James Wolf on YouTube let me use his Yakamar clip so I can salvage this corpse of a video. Anyways, this bird is a perfectly designed predator for a very specific type of animal cute, pretty butterflies. And not just any butterflies, some of the largest and most beautiful species on Earth like the blue morpho and owl butterflies. The Yakamar waits from a high perch until it sees one of these majestic creatures fluttering around. Then it snatches that sucker up and prepares it for a horrible death. You see, the butterflies it hunts are so big that their wings can't really fit into its mouth, and the scales they're covered in aren't all that appetizing. So it uses that long bill to grind that poor sucker up against its perch until its wings are ripped off, then swallows that fella down whole. But an even more disturbing fate awaits for any shiny beetles it comes across, as it rips their beautiful bodies apart to decorate the outside of its nest. That's like decorating your baby's crib with the corpses of all the roast chicken you've ever eaten. It's pretty brutal. And some Yakamar go beyond just eating insects. The great Yakamar will even eat lizards and other vertebrates. This bizarre hummingbird looking predator is one of the many amazing birds I filmed in Costa Rica. And I look forward to showcasing the other amazing species this country has to offer. A huge thank you is in order for James Wolf for providing that awesome Yakamar B-roll. His YouTube video is in the description. Their content saved this video from being me rambling about this five second clip, so a huge thank you's in order. If you want to see my previous and upcoming birding content, be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.